Hello everyone, it's Wonko here, and welcome back to Wonko Plays Minecraft Dirtcraft. So we're back on the server, I've just been into the nether to get a little bit of nether quartz, because we're going to start off today with a slight little project on working on the iron golem farm. Specifically, building a system that will filter out all of the roses, which are really, really annoying. You're picking things up, so... The last to do that, and we're doing it. Right. Sorry if the sounds are a bit loud around the nether portal. But yes, I'm going to get everything together I think we'll need. I'll go review my old videos on how I used to do the hopper sorters, and be right back. Okay, guys. So here we are at the Iron Golem farm. Basically the golems fall down, or well, the generators up there, they fall down here into the water stream, get pushed there, killed, and dead. Uh, Slay Magic's there just AFKing at the farm right at the moment. Then basically all of the loot is brought into this long line of droppers, dropped all the way up to the top, then brought like this, and all of these storage chests allowed to fill up on the way down. On the way, what we want to do is be able to get rid of all of the roses. So, let's see if I can remember how to do this then. So what I... Th yeah, back, just gonna check the video again. Okay, so I think this was how we did it. So, we need a torch there, we can get rid of this block here. And what we do is put this comparator here. Yeah, sorry for the lag, this farm is awfully laggy. It's not usually like this on the server. Then we get some regular redstone and put it there and there. We get a torch and put it there, already done that. We get a uh, repeater and put it there. And Right, then we fill this with those things. Uh, so let's find some more poppies. So, put down our poppies and you'll see they'll start to filter through until we get 18 of them and then it stops. So if any more pop poppies come in, they'll go straight out again. And that's great. The only problem we have now is getting rid of the poppies. That is the only problem left. Uh, probably a dispenser is the best way to do it. Dispense it in lava. Uh, there aren't a whole load of great ways to destroy items with the pistons still, but there we go. Do 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 do. Great. Well, I'll I'll get a uh, dispenser then. See you in a second. Okay, got a dispenser, so hopefully we put it here, then we cover this up, we break the glass, and we seal this up, Right, so this is in fact powered by the same mechanism that's powering all the other dispensers. Because that's where it is. What is powering this? Why is it so laggy? What? what, what? What's going on here? What's powering the torches? Where's the clock? 
The torches are here. What's powering it? Isn't it? What's going on here? Ah. Oh. Really? <laughs> so how the system works is when it detects something there, then it sends a signal that unlocks this clock and allows things to start going upwards, which is a good idea in theory, except it all gets stuck about there. Weird. Yeah, because I guess... I don't know. I don't know. I do not know. I have a... What is going on here? <coughs> I thought I had it figured out, but I don't know anymore. So, let's try and get all of the roses we can out of the system. Which they might already be, hopefully. Someone's gone through and done that. Not quite. Okay. That might actually be all of the roses gone. Good. That is very good. So... Is that, oh, this lag. Don't get this anywhere else on the server. But yes, this machine still seems to work, even though the dispenser's here. It filters out all of the things. that just make sure there's no build-up here. Nope. That's perfect. Absolutely perfect. Right, well, that system's working. Awesome. Let's get back to doing other things. Hello everyone and welcome back. So down in the mine shaft here and I've been branch mining so as you recall we were digging out 50 blocks in that direction and I've extended it down here and further down and all the way down here and all the way down here but finally at the end oh yeah no this one after digging over lava Diamonds. Awesome. First diamonds on the server. And there's five of them, which is enough for a pickaxe and an enchanting table. You'll notice I have 34 levels. That's mostly as a result of not having died in a while. And not being able to enchant anything. There we go. Awesome. Okay, here we are. And here comes the pickaxe. Aha. Yes. And the obsidian. And now we just need a book, which I'll go get. All right, guys, let's do this. So, here we go. Enchanting table. Don't know. Achievement get. Uh, so, yeah, I don't really have anywhere to put this yet. And similarly, I don't have any bookshelves to put around it. Which is great. Fully prepared over here. So, yeah, I've, I've been getting, making, 
I got some cows from way off there and I've been harvesting some wheat and breeding them so I've got almost enough leather for all of these item frames in here but I don't have enough yet to start making bookshelves so that could be a while and I think actually we can put the enchanting table through here I think we're going to do that that would be cool Okay. Hello everyone. I swear wheat didn't used to take this long to grow. I swear it used to be done in a single day night cycle. <sighs> but there we go. Maybe I'm just remembering things incorrectly. But good progress is being made on all fronts. You can probably see the dome is coming along nicely. We've been working on that, building it out of glass. I built the first general scaffold out of planks, but now using glass instead, and it looks good. It's a good sized dome. 
It's a bit of a strange graphical effect. Hang on. No? Not passing through any regions, but... I know, it just looked like there was a strange graphical effect. I don't know. But still, from below, it's a good sized dome. Good sized dome. How does it. Sorry, that just looks different for some reason, so maybe it's one of these two. It did it. There we go. That looks better. And then. Still haven't really worked out what those things do, except I know one blurs textures together the further away you get. That didn't seem to have any impact at all. Okay, but yeah, that looks better. So there we go. The Wonko's Dome is coming on. So... We're back to slaughtering our cows. I had a lot of cows here. Except I slaughtered almost all of them to get leather for the frames and I left myself with only three or four left. So it's taking longer than it should to repopulate them. Oh well, no one to blame there but myself. Okay. So that's coming on, we'll have an enchanting table soon, we've got plenty of levels, the dome's coming on, we've got more glass smelting, and everything is being very nice. Done our community service for the day, we've got the rose filter set up. I think I'm going to call it just about there guys, thanks for watching. Let's see if I can do this from the bottom.